Hello, I'm Kate Barron, president of PA Media Group. Welcome to the 2020 edition of the Best and Brightest Awards, this time done as a virtual celebration. Tonight we'll be honoring 20 top high school students from around the region. And to start the festivities, here's the Best and Brightest coordinator, Deb Kiner. Hi, I'm Deb Kiner, and I am the coordinator of the Best and Brightest program for PennLive.com and the Patriot News. This is our 28th year of honoring students with the Best and Brightest program. And of course, it is the first time that we are doing this virtually. I really am disappointed that I'm not gonna get to meet each of you and your families in person. But regardless of that, I am still humbled and awed by your success. We had 147 applications. The judges narrowed that down to the final 20. And it's not an easy job. We have 10 boys and 10 girls that we're honoring today. They are athletes, musicians, scouts, scholars, volunteers, and people who genuinely care about others. Thank you for being here as we honor the best and brightest class of 2020. The 28th Annual Best and Brightest Awards would not be possible without our generous sponsors, Renewal by Anderson. And here with a few words is Linda Johnston. Renewal by Anderson is thrilled to partner with Penn Live to present this year's Best and Brightest virtual award show. Our schools feature so many of the most innovative young minds who are our future teachers, healthcare workers, CEOs, and leaders of so many other fields. Like every year, there was no shortage of strong applications, and we are excited to introduce these shining stars of the class of 2020. Our keynote speaker is a veteran broadcast journalist and media personality. Here she is, Flora Posterero. Hi everyone, I'm Flora Posterero. I am the creator and co-host of my own video audio podcast. It's called Chick to Chick. I am a multimedia specialist for a website called penwatch.org. I'm also a veteran TV anchor and reporter. Now I was asked to be a judge for this competition. I was honored uh, to read all of your essays and I was just blown away. There is no doubt in my mind, all of you are the best and you are the very brightest. I was so impressed with your academic accomplishments. I, I was just so touched by the many obstacles that you've had to overcome. And yet all of you found time to give back. You gave back to your community and you made a difference. In my mind, you've already found the secret to success. So if you decide to go on to college or maybe you're gonna go on to learn a skill or learn a trade, or maybe you're at that point where you wanna start your career. There is no doubt in my mind that all of you are going to be a great success. Continue to give back in life, continue to find the positive in life. You know, I like to use this analogy that life is kind of like a roller coaster ride. You have these ups and then you have the downs. Now the ups are easy, right? Because we're happy, we're having fun, it's great, life is good. But how do you handle the downs? How do you handle things when they're down here? Do you handle them with grace and dignity? Also, try to find the positive in every negative situation. There's always a lesson to learn and come out of that by learning something and always look at things in a positive light. I'd like to end this with um, a favorite quote of mine. It's very short, but boy, it means so much. And this quote is by Winston Churchill, and it goes something like this. You make a living by what you get, but you make a life by what you give. Congratulations again. You are the best. You are the brightest. Congratulations. Okay, let's get this show on the road. Veteran Penn Live reporter Steve Maroney can take it from here. Alisher Amanov is a student at Commonwealth Charter Academy and finished high school in two and a half years, finishing with a 4.3 GPA. He is the founder of Yellow Brick Robotics, a nonprofit that teaches elementary and middle school children about physics, coding, and robotics. He will be studying social psychology at Harvard in the fall of 2021. Alisher, congratulations. congratulations on being the best and brightest in Pennsylvania. You've worked really hard to achieve this. And we are super proud of you and we can't wait to see what the future holds. We know no matter what you do through now and throughout the future, you'll be extremely successful. 
with your drive and determination. We look forward to seeing what the future holds for you, and we just wish you all the best. Congratulations, Alisher. Congratulations, Alisher. Congratulations, Alisher, on being selected as one of Central Pennsylvania's best and brightest. Alisher, congratulations for being in the best and brightest. Congratulations for being one of the best and brightest, Alisher. Congratulations, Alisher, for winning the best and brightest. Congratulations, Alisher. I'm so proud you're my brother. Congratulations, Alisher. To me, you're the same boy in this picture, yet you have grown into such a fine young man. I am proud of you beyond words and could not love you more. Mandy Armstrong is a student at Susquehanna High School. A star basketball and softball player, she's a leader both on and off the field, acting as student council vice president. Having had five concussions, she'll be using her past experience to help others as she studies physical therapy at Lebanon Valley College. Congratulations, Manny Lee. Super proud of you, kiddo. Love you so much. Maya Aurora is a student at Trinity High School. She created the Community Voices Together volunteer program, which brings together special needs students at Trinity and Cumberland Valley schools to do community service projects and make friends. She is a member of numerous honor societies and a champion tennis and basketball player. This fall, she will be studying neuroscience and public health at the University of North Carolina at Chapel Hill. Hi, Maya. Nana, Nani, and Uncle and I, we wanted to send you uh, a short message to let you know how proud we are of you. We've uh, seen you grow into a beautiful young lady who has achieved so much. I know it's been hard uh, for you these past couple of months to miss many of your um, senior moments, your senior celebrations, but um, you have been amazing to keep yourself strong and focused and to move forward uh, despite all the challenges of uh, the current uh, coronavirus uh, pandemic. We are confident that you will do amazing things in college and in life. Um, so stay strong, um, be kind, and persevere. We love you so much and we will always support you no matter what. Nathan Brubaker is a student at Donegal High School. He's no stranger to hard work, living on a 1,200 cow family dairy farm, running with his school's track and field team, and volunteering to help his community. He will study biological engineering at Cornell University. Congratulations to the one and only Nathan Grape on making the most of your time at Donegal. You truly do belong among the best and the brightest. Congratulations. Hi, Nathan. Congratulations. Keep challenging others to think observantly. Congratulations, Nate. You're so deserving of this honor, and I'm so proud of you. Hey, old Maple. This is Doc. Congratulations, and I know you'll do well whatever you set your sights to. Take care. Hey, Nate. Congratulations. You're definitely one of the best and the brightest, and I'm proud to be your brother. Nate, I am so proud of all your accomplishments, your character, your integrity, and the man you've become, and I'm proud to be your dad. Congratulations, Nate. Congratulations, Nathan. I look up to you a lot. Love you, bro. You are such a gift to our family. Your love of learning and your adventurous spirit will be a great asset to you wherever God leads you. We love you. Congratulations. Rachel Collison is a student at Penn Manor High School. She has a passion for helping others and using her voice to better the world around her. She's active in both Model UN and the Young Humanitarian League and will be attending the University of Pennsylvania on a full scholarship to major in anthropology and political science. Congratulations, Rachel. I'm so proud to be your sister. This, this is only the beginning of great things for you. We love you. We love you. Connor Coyle is a student at Trinity High School. He is an accomplished trombone player with a talent for French and a passion for community service, two things that he will no doubt use in his future studying the Foreign Service at Georgetown University. Connor, we are so proud of all that you have accomplished during your four years of high school. Your hard work and dedication have allowed you to excel academically while also taking on leadership roles at school, performing in music ensembles both in and out of school, competing on the quiz bowl team, and volunteering at church and in the community. What makes us most proud of you is that you are a kind and compassionate young man who recognizes the importance of service to others. 
You have so much to offer and we know that the world is and will continue to be a better place because you are here. We are so excited to see what lies ahead for you. We love you. Maxwell Hahn is a student at Mechanicsburg Area Senior High School. He is an Eagle Scout and served as a Senior Patrol Leader and Junior Assistant Scout Master. He is a licensed shortwave radio operator and certified in SCUBA. He will attend Penn State University majoring in mathematics and political science. Hey Max! Hi Max, just want to tell you how proud I am of you. Good luck next year at Penn State and thanks for being an awesome brother. Another year of adversity for you, you've handled it quite well. We're proud of you. Congrats on the best and brightest. So for my part of the message, Max, I decided that we needed to do a little math. So the solution to this equation is how much we love you. So I'll give you a minute. If you got infinity, not only are you correct, but now you also know how much we love you. We're very proud of you, buddy. Mwah. Great job, Max. Abigail Hahn is a senior at Hershey High School. She plays varsity golf, is a Girl Scout, and participates in track and field. She was named to the Mid-Penn Conference All-Star Golf Team. She will attend Penn State University to major in chemistry. Congratulations, Abby. Abs, we're so proud of everything you've done, everything you are, and all the things you will be. We only wish that we could all be together to get to meet your other best and brightest, to hear about everything that they've accomplished, and to get to know them as well. We know that you're going to change the world. You already have. Congratulations. I am thrilled to share in this special moment with you, Abby. You are a prized student athlete and always have been. And I'm not surprised that you are a recipient of this prestigious award. Congratulations, I'm so proud of you and congratulations on your acceptance to Penn State. Best in the coming year. Tyler Harker is a student at Dauphin County Technical School. He is drum major of the Halifax Marching Band, plays soccer, and owns Tyler's Taylor Tales Animal Grooming, Care, and Sitting Business. He will attend Cornell University for the Accelerated Veterinary School Program. Congratulations on being named one of the best and brightest in Central Pennsylvania for your achievements in high school. We are so very proud of you, but not as much for what you've done and accomplished, but for the incredible young man that you are. We know that your senior year didn't end quite as you had planned, but we are proud of you for taking it all in stride and for being appreciative of all the things that others are doing to celebrate you and seniors rather than focusing on what you've lost. We are proud of you for your loyal and caring heart and your thoughtfulness of others, especially your friends and family. We are proud of you for finding so much joy in the world, even when it gets tough. You make us laugh all the time, and we love you for all your goofy quirks. We are proud of you for leaning into your faith and for always standing up for what you believe in. Tyler, you are an incredible son, brother, grandson, nephew, cousin, and friend. And we are so proud that the rest of the world will now get to know you for what we have already known for years, because you have been one of the best and brightest parts of our world. We love you and we are so proud of you and we can't wait to see what God's plan unfolds for you next. Congratulations, Tyler. We love you. William Hoover is a student at Mechanicsburg Area Senior High School. He plays football and baseball and was particularly moved by an AP Human Geography class that resulted in fundraising for a school in Kenya. He will attend Bucknell University to major in mechanical engineering. Will, we are so proud of you. And so are many other people. Congratulations, Will! Great job, Will. We love you. Congratulations, Congratulations Will. Will! We're proud of you. Will Power! Way to go, Will! Woo! Congratulations, Will. Will! We're so proud of you. Congratulations, Congratulations Will! Woo! Woo! <laughs> Congrats, William. We're proud of you. I love you. See, there were a lot of people who really are proud of you, William. Even me. Congratulations, buddy. We look forward to what the future brings. We love you. Lindsay Kaiser is a student at Northern Lebanon High School. She is the drum major of the marching band, plays flute, and takes voice lessons. She is in the youth choir and bell choir at church. She will attend Lebanon Valley College with dual majors in chemistry and mathematics. Hi, Lindsay. 
Dad and I feel so much joy for you today. You've worked so hard in classes and in everything you've done to reach some amazing goals you've set for yourself. This is an amazing recognition of that hard work. Congratulations. And keep working hard and being the amazing, quirky, loving, generous person you are. We can't wait to see what the future holds for you. We know you'll do amazing things. Congratulations, Lindsay. Jason Klein is a student at Central Dauphin High School. He is captain of the tennis team and has been the top singles player for three years, co-captain of the soccer team, and has gone on to district and state competition. He will attend the College of William and Mary. Hi, Jason. Congratulations on best and the brightest and a wonderful high school career and valedictorian and all your successes. We wish you continued luck and health and happiness in the future. Yeah, buddy, congratulations. You've done a terrific job for all four years. We're unbelievably proud of you and wish you the best of luck in the future and everything you do. We love you very much. Love you. Elizabeth Landis is a student at West York Area High School. She is an all-state swimmer, marching band drum major, plays saxophone, is president of the student council, and works as a lifeguard. She will attend the University of Rochester, majoring in pre-medicine. Hi Ellie, it's your family here, just to tell you how much we love you and how proud we are of you. Ellie has always made goals for herself and worked very, very hard to reach them. And I know she'll do fine the rest of her life and she'll always remember how much we love her. We love you and wish you all the success in the world. Congratulations Ellie, we are so, so proud of you. To our Ellie, our Elbel, our Ellie Belly, our Penny, our Elizabeth Marie, we love you so very much and we are so very proud of you. And here's our virtual hug just to show you how much we love you. Go out in your future and show everybody what a fantastic, loving, caring person you are. I know that you're going to touch so many people. Good luck, sweetheart. We love you. Xenia McCoskey is a student at Carlisle High School. Her passion is literacy, something she became involved with in the fourth grade. She also is a talented musician playing flute with the Harrisburg Symphony Youth Orchestra, and she raises chickens. She will attend Dickinson College. Hey Zenny, just wanted to say congratulations for being one of the best and brightest for 2020. You've done so much to make me, mom, and dad proud. We love you so much, and congratulations, and we can't wait to see what your future has in store for you. Congratulations, Zenny, for being the best and the brightest. We love you. <laughs> Bye -bye. Yay. Congratulations, Zenny. That's a wonderful accomplishment. We're very proud of you. Congratulations. Good job. Good job. Good job. This is so big. Jose Perez Atune is a student at Gettysburg Area High School. He has a passion for social justice and activism, is a musician, writer, and president of the Gender and Sexuality Alliance at school. He will attend Cornell University as an industrial and labor relations major. Hi everyone, I'm Victoria Setune, I'm Jose's mom. Thank you to Penn Life and the Vesa Bright team for choosing Jose for this award. I'm very excited about his future, I'm very proud of his accomplishments, and I wish you all the best. I love you, Jose. Thank you. Yo soy Victoria Setune, la madre de Jose. Gracias al equipo de Pen Life and the Best and Brightest por haber escogido a Jose para este premio. Estoy muy orgullosa de sus logros. Ha trabajado muy fuerte y emocionada también estoy de sus próximos logros en el colegio. Les deseo a todos lo mejor. Muchas gracias. Megan Ruoro is a student at Bishop McDevitt High School. She has excelled in theater, in particular with the Sankofa African American Theater Company. She will attend Yale University with a double major in theater studies and political science. My beautiful daughter Megan, I am so proud of you and what you have accomplished as you have grown into a beautiful, beautiful young lady. You inspire me to be a better mom every day and I thank God for the gift that he gave me and that's you. Time has gone very fast. I remember it like it, it was yesterday when we would watch Elmo together and you would belt Elmo songs at the top of your little lungs and here you are going off to college. 
you have shown an example that hard work, extra laughter, and extra extra screams with your friends can lead you to your dreams. I cannot wait to see what God has for you in your future. I wish you all the beautiful things of the world and pray that God watches over you. I am so proud of you today and always. I love you. Elijah Schreiber is homeschooled. He and his family are strong advocates for foster care and adoption. He is active in his church, teaches Spanish to younger students, and plays volleyball. He will attend Eastern University to major in nursing. Hey bud, congratulations. And we love you very much. Congratulations, Elijah. I'm so proud of you. Congratulations, Elijah. You truly are one of the best and brightest. Elijah, we're really proud of you. Congratulations. Hey, Elijah. Congratulations. We're really proud of you, Elijah. Love you. Elijah, we are so proud of you. Congratulations! Hey, bud. Everybody out here in Collinsville couldn't be more proud of you. You're going to go on to do amazing things. Keep up the great work. Love you. Hey, Elijah. Wanted to say congratulations, man. You deserve this award. Congratulations. You're amazing. You're amazing. Congratulations, Elijah. We're so happy for your blessings, and we pray that you'll continue to be blessed throughout your days. Well done, Elijah. Elijah, congratulations. You rock your socks. Congrats, Elijah. The world is at your fingertips. I'm so excited to see what you do with it. Love you, Elijah. Congratulations. Nina Shi is a student at Lancaster Country Day School. She is a gifted violinist who studies at the Peabody Conservatory of Baltimore. She also studies art at the University of Pennsylvania. She will attend Princeton University. Congratulations, Nina. We're so proud of you. We love you. We wish you all the best for your future and all your endeavors from here on. Congratulations again, Nina. Love you. JT Thomas is a student at Central Dolphin East High School. He is a gifted cross-country runner, actor, and musician. He will attend Penn State University in the Classics and Mediterranean Studies program. Hey, JT. So, Dad's in Iowa, and I'm here in the basement. But we really wanted to send you this video to tell you how proud we are and to tell you congratulations for your accomplishments and we love you very much. Congratulations, buddy, on being nominated for the brightest. But we both know the best is yet to come. Good job. We love you, bud. Isabella Zuccarelli is a student at Cumberland Valley High School. She plays lacrosse, volunteers at two hospitals, and is president of the school's CV African Club, a venture inspired by her South African roots. She will attend Johns Hopkins University, majoring in chemistry. Congratulations, Isabella, on winning the best and brightest. I'm so proud of you and so happy for you. When we came to America, we came for all the opportunities and you certainly have made the most of those. I'm really looking forward to seeing the young woman you will become and I love you very much. Yes, I share those sentiments, Isabella. Uh, Mom and Dad are extremely happy for you and your achievements um, over the past 11, 12 years, um, that we, 11 years that we've been here. Um, not just for academic uh, accolades, but for becoming a well-rounded well person, uh, your philanthropist activities, your community activities, uh, and just for being a well-rounded, good person, which is all important in this day and age, in this world we live in. I'm so happy to be here with you, Isabella, at this very special time from South Africa, and congratulations, I'm very proud of you. Thank you for joining us for the 2020 annual Best and Brightest presentation. We're so proud to host this program. Congratulations to all our winning high school seniors and congratulations to the entire class of 2020. I'm Kate Barron, wishing you a good evening.